Welcome back to another episode of Around the Yard. I'm Megan Dunn. And I'm Mark Hartzell. Here's what's been happening around campus. Dance Marathon took place this past Saturday in TD Arena. The event raised over $60,000, and over the past 10 years, the organization has raised over half a million dollars for MUSC Children's Hospital. The college has officially launched its very own Snapchat channel. The channel will feature baseball games, special events, student insights, and special guests. The Office of Sustainability traveled to Columbia this past weekend to present an array of projects. These projects focus on ocean life as well as zero waste events. The Film Club has been doing a series of projects recently. Riley Clark has the story. This is Riley Clark with Cistern Yard, and once again, students never cease to amaze with what they do with their passions. Another example being the CFC Filmmakers Club. They've gotten together and collaborated with the Filmmakers Club through Trident Tech, and together they are producing a short film. We make movies. Yeah. That's what we do. It's fun. In the fall, we're going to do the script and pre-production and get all that done, and then work in the spring with actual production and post-production. The club has been working on a short film, Losing Faith. The film is about a dark romance with the plot being about a boy and girl who meet in group therapy and the adventurous events that follow. Um, this project is called Losing Faith and um, in one of our first meetings, uh, Lindsay was like, what do we want to start off with? She kind of did like the man versus nature kind of thing. And then Donald, who was actually our lead actor, decided uh, he's a psychology major and wanted to do something in that kind of aspect. Starts off with him meeting her at, at a counseling session and they kind of progress and get to know each other and some stuff happens that kind of later affects the later stuff and then it's... Stuff happens and more yeah. stuff happens. And especially <laughs> the whole movie is essentially a flashback kind of thing. Yeah. The club hopes to have the project done in time for festivals that will be going on in November. The club still encourages that anyone can join the club and if you want to know what's going on in their world, check them out by following CFC Filmmakers Club on any social media. This is Riley Clark with Cistern Yard. Now here's Sam with some sports updates. It's a busy week around campus for the College of Charleston Athletics as baseball is in full swing and the basketball season's winding down. The women's basketball team wrapped up their se uh, home season on Thursday night with a 44 point victory on senior night. Uh, they'll play their last game of the regular season on Saturday at James Madison before beginning the Colonial Athletic Association tournament next week. In men's basketball, team dropped their last game of the regular season last Saturday. They'll prepare for a Friday night contest with Delaware at 8.30 in the first round of the CAA tournament. You can see that on CAA.TV, so be sure to tune in and support the Cougars. In baseball, uh, team won their most recent game over Coastal Carolina. That improves them to four and four on the season. And they'll face crosstown rival the Citadel this weekend in a home and home. And that's all for sports this week. Have a great break and go Cougars. Here are some upcoming events happening around campus. The IFC will be selecting a new fraternity to join Greek life in the fall. Presentations are open to the campus community and the next presentation will be March 15th at 6 p.m. in Robert Scott Small 235. Accepted Students Weekend is around the corner and the college is looking for volunteers. If you are interested, email admissions events at cfc.edu. Zeta Tau Alpha will be hosting their Crown Chase 5K April 10th at James Island County Park. To register for the event, check out strictlyrunning.com. That's all we have for this week's episode of Around the Yard. Be sure to leave your comments below and be sure to subscribe to Sister Nard Video to stay updated on everything happening around campus. Also follow us on Instagram and Twitter at Sister Nard underscore video. For Around the Yard, I'm Megan Dunn. And I'm Mark Hartzell.